everyone and welcome to another episode of Irongo Talk. Today we join you from Wolfish Bay, specifically the Billy Props Cafe here in Wolfish Bay. My name is Leandre Lo and today I'm joined by Tiro Kariseb. And in today's episode we bring you the latest news, entertainment and sports as well as weather and tides. Yes, and since it's Friday we bring you a song as well. We chat to Danine van Nikerk who is the organizer of the Swakopmund Night Market who is officially back. Um, after it was um, last hosted a year ago. So please don't go anywhere. We'll be right back after this. En nou is het tijd vir julle sy nies, um, hier vanaf die Willy Props Café in Walvis Baai. Nou, hier die harde woorde het geval, vrijdag toen een mobiese aanlandige mas bankerwerkers, een twee uur lange noodvergadering met Dr. Albert Kawana, die minister, minister van Visserije en Marien Hulpronne, oor die krisis in die segment van die visbedrijf, visbedrijf gehad het. Dit volg nadat Kawana die Orongo streek verlede week besoek het om met verskye belanghebbenis in die visbedrijf te, te vergaan. Hader. Nou die visverdrijf bedrijf bloei na die regering sy viskota veiling in 2020 mislik het en nie die ekonomiese oplewing gebring het waarop dit gehoop was nie. Die eienaars van visfabrieke wat maspanker vang en bal toe bring om aan, aan landig te verwerk probeer reeds maanden lang hulle komplekse en technieks technische uitdagings onder regerings aandag bring en het vroer verjaar in briewe aan Kawana en president Hagi Genk opgevra hy uitvoerende taakspan bestaande uit kindiges moet aangesteel word om aan hulle dilemma aandag te gee. Nou die aanlandige maas bankerverwerkers dring onder meer daarop op dat exclusieve visvangzones vir hulle geskep moet word. As dit nie gebeur nie staan hulle gevaar om binnen die volgende twee maanden onder te gaan waarna meer as 2000 werknemers op straat sal beland. Hulle soek en pas met die gebruik elders in die wereld een voorgee gebied van 30 meter tot 50 meter waar die maatskapie met groot fabrieksbote wat bevriesing op see doen nie toegelaat word om saam met die aanlandige werk vir werkers as een kleiner visser bote vis te vang nie. Maar nou Kawana, um, dit is die om dokter Albert Kawana het daar nou gesê, dit sal nie moendlik wees nie as gevolg van dit nou mooie deel is van die um, blauw ekonomie um, zone. Maar jylle kan gerust op onze webwerf van Loer wat precies daar gebeur het en dit is by www.irongo.com.na Now moving on to some sports that's happening over the weekend. Um, a total of 100 of the coastal swimmers a total of 144 coastal swimmers will travel to the um, to the capital for the 2021 Bank Bentuk National Long Course Championships taking place from Thursday, that is 11, that was yesterday, to Sunday 14 March at the Olympia Swimming Pool. Now these swimmers are from seven swimming clubs, which is the Aqua and Fitness Club, Dolphin Swimming Club, Flipper Swimming Club, Marlins Aquatic Club, Orania Moon Sh um, Sand Sharks, Phoenix Swimming Academy and Swakop Moon Swimming Academy will battle it out in 48. 84 heat. No ceremonies or medal presentations will be staged on the final day of the, um, the four-day event. However, medals and trophies will be sent to the winning clubs and swimmers. And then, um, nog iets in Afrikaans, hier oor die naweek in Walvis Bay, die Namibiese vlugbalverenigings sal die 2021 Bank Windhoek Swak op Moend openstrand vlugbal competitie kom in Satrach by die Mole op die Kistorp aanbied. Met maatreels die in COVID-19 in plek sal, sal die toernooi verout en jonk wees. Dit, daar is afdelingse senior man, senior vrouwen, onder 17 spelers, sociale paren, as ook gemengde vier aan een kant spannen. Die open kampioenskamp is daarop gemak om een mobiese vlugbalspelers vir alle streken te lok. Maar jylle kan gerust hierna gaan loer en soveel meer wat daar op ons webwerf gebeur, dit is www.irongo.com.na Dit is www.irongo.com.na En dit is jylle sinies vir vandag.
joined here by Janine uh, Faniker, who is the organizer of the Sokopun Night Market. So, how are you doing? Hi, I'm doing very well, thank you. Alright. Alright. Um, yeah, tell me, like Sokopun Night Market is back, like it's such an, an, a brilliant surprise. Um, tell us what, when it's happening, uh, what it's going to be all about. Yes, we're so excited that the market can finally take place again. It's been a whole year exactly since the last market, yeah. which was on Valentine's Day last year. And we were busy planning the independence market um, and then this COVID thing hit us and now, ironically, we're starting off with the next um, independence market. Okay. It will take place on the uh, 20th of March and we're planning on having it here at Tiger Reef. Yeah. Um, we have loads of stalls booked already um, and lots of things to look forward to, especially to entertain the kids in jumping castles and pony rides and face painting and all sorts of fun things So, I mean, I'm sure a lot of like, um, uh, a lot of residents are so excited for the Sokobu Night Market t t to be back. How does it feel for you as an organizer? Well, I, I'm probably the most excited out of everyone. Yes. I've missed it extremely. Um, the residents and the response from everyone has been overwhelming. My phone mm. hasn't stopped ringing. <laughs> yeah. I'm getting <laughs> messages on all platforms from Telegram to uh, WhatsApp and Instagram and Facebook and just trying to keep track of everything. So um, it feels to me as if everyone is very excited and looking forward to the market. Awesome. So now, what, what can people do in terms of if they want to book a store? What can what what is the the, the go to place or the, the numbers well, to them? Yeah. Um, yeah. To book a store, you just contact me directly. The store bookings don't go through Tiger Reef. Yeah. Um, so you can either email me or you can phone me on my cell phone or send me a message. Like I said, messages are coming from all over the place. Mm -hmm. And basically, um, should we have any stores available, then I just basically chat to you and find out what it is that you want to sell. And we just go through the booking procedure. Um, and then basically when you've paid your store fee, your store is confirmed and everything is ready for you to, you know, to go. <laughs> Alright, what are the magic numbers? Who should, what number should they dial and email as well? Okay, you can call me on 081 um, or send me a WhatsApp. Like I said, you can reach us on Facebook. Um, the page name is Swakopon Night Market. We've created an event um, co-hosted by Tiger Reef. So you can go look for the event. You can follow the event on Facebook. You can contact me through that page um, or you can send me an email at swapofnightmarket at gmail.com. Alright, awesome. In terms of um, COVID-19 mitigating or let's say measures, uh, what can we expect from night market, uh, Sokomo Night Market to ensure that that is also um, adhered to? Yes. Well, we are just going to follow the um, regulations as they are at the moment. We encourage the wearing of face masks. We'll have hand sanitizer at the entrance. I've also asked my schools to have san uh, hand sanitizer handy for those uh, just to be able to sanitize on a more regular basis. Yes. Um, we obviously also encourage social distancing. Luckily, we have a lot of space here, so we don't have to be on top of each other. It's open air. Um, and yeah, that's it. Just if by this time, everybody knows what the rules are. Mm -hmm. um, we'll also obviously try and control the crowd as much as we can, just by letting a certain amount of people in at a time. Um, but hopefully with the market hours being extended and the market starting at 10 a.m., mm -hmm. there's the whole day available people to visit the market. People go in and out. So yes, yeah, so yeah. hopefully that will also help to control the crowd so that there's not too many people in a short time period yes. in the area. All right, thank you very much, Denise. Thank you. It was you. a pleasure having you on the show. Thank you so much. All right.
And now it's time for your entertainment news. The Namibian National Symphony Orchestra, in collaboration with the College of Art, stages a live-streamed concert, a musical festival that will be hosted on Saturday the 13th, under the direction of well-known conductor Alexander Falkens. Funded by Bank Vintuk, the 75-minute concert gives talent, talented young musicians the opportunity to perform together with a string orchestra. To adhere to the COVID-19 regulations, the NNSO will host the show with, without any live audiences. Um, however, the live stream concert will be free of charge on the official website and on their social media handler that's on Facebook um, on um, www.nnso.info. That's their website. According to the chairperson, Ms. Renner Men, the production traditionally called, uh, b called the Baroque Festival requires only a small stringed orchestra. The musicians are eager to play together ever since um, February. We appreciate Bank Vantuk ongoing financial contribution to provide the necessary means and continuous success in the sustainability of this music project, she concludes. And into our second story, the organizers of the Sokobund Night Market, Daniel van Niekerk, said that the night market um, will be back ever since February 2020. According to her, the event is scheduled to take place on the 20th of March at Tiger Reef at the 4x4 parking lot. We are very excited, she says. The market will, ha will be held under the theme Independence Day. We'll be having one big beach party for the Independence Day with market stalls, a gin bar and a jumping castles and lots of live music throughout the day and the evening. She continues, street food, local goodies and crafts are also expected to be available for sale. Now in spite of the existing regulations, the fund is set to resume. It will be con compulsory for everybody in attendance to wear a mask and keep their social distance. She says there will also be a sanitizer dispenser at the entrance. The Sokumund night market will start at 10 a.m. in the morning, a day before the 31st uh, of March, that's the Independence Day's anniversary, and will run up until 8 o'clock in the evening. Now, adults are, will be required a $10 fee at the gate, while the babies and the toddlers will be allowed to enter for free. Now, for anybody that is interested in renting or booking a stall, please call this number 81 129 You can also use that number 0129 for any general inquiries or you can write them an email that's at swakopnightmarket at gmail.com swakopnightmarket at gmail.com and with that wraps up my entertainment story. I'm going to go in with your foundation. Now you're going to go in with your beauty blender and tap that. Then next you're going to try to apply that on the skin. Don't do this, just tap it in. Do you really want to 
blend that well because blending is key. Mm -hmm. Then once you're done with your foundation, you're going to go in with some concealer. I'm going to be using the LA Girl Pro Concealer. Now I'm going to go in with a brush. And then I'm going to add that to your under eye. Usually some people have dark circles or dark skin tones. So you guys can use the LA Girl Pro Concealer Corrector. Those are very good for covering dark circles. Then you guys are going to go in with some powder. Try this powder. You want to set your face. And then we're going to contour. So you don't want to add too much contour. Some people have cream contour, I have powder contour because it works best for me and the client. So you just want to follow the jawline and you want to bring it upwards just like that and go into circle motions and try to blend that. And you want to blend it upwards to bring out the jaw. And then what I like to do to contour, I like to go in a three to help me contour. You guys can also use that tip. And that's how you contour. Thank you guys so much for watching. Okay, now we bring you the coming events for the weekend, what's happening here in the Rongo region. Now firstly, the Omarura community members are called on to join a clean-up, that's tomorrow. Now um, the assembly points are at Shell service station, that's from 8 o'clock, and Ozonje taxi rank at 9 o'clock. So everyone, if you find yourselves in the Omaruru community or in the Omaruru vicinity, please join the cleanup. Another day, a thing happening here in Warfish Bay is that Novo Fort Warfish Bay will be hosting an open day for the ladies. Now basically, this is going to be a do-it-yourself for women. Now what you will learn is how to change a tire how to refill wiper water, how to do an oil check, and identifying war warning lights. So um, they are going to start from 9 o'clock tomorrow morning, and it's going to be until 1 o'clock. Now, on the sports front, um, the Grand Prix Athletics will also be taking place at the Venita um, Sports Stadium in Swakopmund from 10 o'clock to 12.30. Now, this gathering is limited to 50 people, so that is basically only the athletes and the um, 
the, the, the coaches, so no spectators are allowed. But you can still check out our website or our Facebook page for the latest um, updates on that one. And then in terms of hockey, the Bank Vintuk Indoor League is in full swing. Now tomorrow um, afternoon, that's at 3 o'clock, the Sparta men will play against the Mustangs. And then on Sunday, the Sparta men will play again, again against the um, Wanderers, that's at 12 o'clock. Now both matches are at the Dome. So if you have any events happening at the coast or in the rest of the Irongo region, you can let us know. That's at 0811-7040, either on WhatsApp or on Telegram, 0811-7040. And now it is time for your weather and tides for all the major towns here in the Irongo region. Unfortunately, that brings us to the end of today's episode of Irongo Talk here in Warfish Bay, a cold and misty Warfish Bay, specifically mm -hmm. at the Valley Props Cafe. Now, today I must say I had a lovely time with you today. Yes, it was wonderful. <laughs> now, if you want to know what's happening in the Irongo community, please log on to our website that's at www.irongo.com.na. You can also well, follow us on our social media sites that's at Facebook, Twitter, and on Instagram. You can also interact with us on Telegram and on WhatsApp. That's at 0811-7040. Now that is also your go-to number for advertisements, 0811-7040. Now as you can see, me and Tiro is lounging here on the, on, in the, in the I would have said sun, uh -huh. but it's mist <laughs> now. So we are going to enjoy our weekends. Please stay safe. Enjoy your weekend as well. We're going to play out with a song by Savannah Collins. Enjoy it, enjoy your weekend, stay safe until Monday. Bye-bye.